Hi everybody. Today I want to tell about the measuring or working principle of electromagnetic inductive flow meter. The flow meter is designed for electrically conductive fluids. Do you know the measuring principle of electromagnetic inductive flow meter? Measurement is based on Faraday's law of induction, according to which a voltage is induced in an electrically conductive body which passes through a magnetic field. Thus the induced voltage is proportional to the mean flow velocity, when field strength and pipe diameter are constant. The following expression is applicable to the voltage. Induced voltage, U, equals constant, K, multiplied by magnetic field strength, B, multiplied by mean velocity, V, multiplied by pipe diameter, D. Inside the magnetic inductive flow meter, the fluid passes through a magnetic field applied perpendicular to the direction of flow. An electric voltage is induced by the movement of the fluid, which must have a minimum electrical conductivity. This is proportional to the mean flow velocity and thus to the volume of flow. The induced voltage signal is picked up by two electrodes which are in conductive contact with the fluid and transmitted to a signal converter for a standardized output signal. This method of measurement offers the following advantages. First one is no pressure loss through pipe construction or protruding parts. Second one is only the pipe liner and the electrodes are in contact with the fluid. Third one is measurement is independent of the flow profile and other properties of the fluid. And the fourth one is already the original signal produced is an electrical voltage which is an exact linear function of the mean flow velocity. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more videos.